Humans are truly a rude and rowdy lot. To think they can cause such a ruckus without even showing their faces. The man in pursuit is the kingdom's famed fighter. Though the sun continues to blaze, he continues spiritedly with his chase. <laughs> it would seem that my boundless fame has caused even the evil dragon to lose its nerve. As an enlightened dragon, one cannot tolerate such deranged words. Aha! Evil dragon! I didn't believe you would actually come out and face me! The puny human talks big and employs an aggressive tone. Yet does the substance of his dream back up his claim? Oh. Hmm. Oh, and the beast is silent! Is my dream so grand that even a dragon finds it difficult to consume? As the noble warrior faced off against the evil dragon, the anxious princess and her entourage arrived at last. The nameless servant kept his eyes on the field. The warrior's words have ignited a fire within his heart. I admire his fearless figure. It would be a dream to also one day prove my character. Evil dragon, why do you not speak? Have you finally realized you should cower in fear? I care not for those who are lesser. Your dream is massive, yet hollow in nature. For now, this weak, enlightened dragon still cannot decide if it's fit to eat. Oh, how vile of you to humiliate me! Just because I'm an enemy! I regarded you as a worthy opponent, yet you use such insidious tactics! I, the world-famous fighter, will never fall before your degradation and trickery! You disgust me! The fighter's animated speech kindled a burning flame within even the oft-dispassionate heart of the royal lady. I am long tired of my peaceful boudoir. I wish to fight alongside my soldiers. Though one sees little reason to teach a lesson, perhaps no choice is left in the matter. Too many appetizers before the dish ruins the mood, but just for today, I can entertain an early platter. To everyone's shock, the evil dragon then swallowed the fighter's dream in one big gulp. It is just as I thought, thin and crunchy, though empty under its shell. A most marvelous texture. The warrior was handily defeated. So he was a gifted orator, but never a true fighter. Conceit became his downfall. His power did not match his stature. The dragon remained unsatiated. Under everyone's gaze, it flew away to parts unfamiliar. 